Always the bridesmaid, I don't care. never the bride. Which one are we drinking? Clement's homebrew. Man bear pig. Como se va? This and guy. Frenchie. Random, hey, random Frenchie. Hey, this is my little bro. You've seen him before, Mr. Incognito. And we've got <laughs> well, this a. This is my brother <laughs> and my nephews. That's right. Absolutely that's, that's, right. That's true. <laughs> and we do stuff, especially drink. And guess what I did? I got them all to come to Southern California to drink some beer with me. I mean, what a better ploy than that. So, <laughs> so we're going to do that. What do we got today, Mr. Josh? So tonight we got something that I think is near and dear to Kevin's heart. He asked me years ago to find him the Silva Stout. This isn't just the normal Silva Stout. This is from Green Flash Brewing. It's the Cellar 3, the recently opened division, I guess, of their barrel aging program. Uh, this is the Silva Stout, but barrel aged. It was brewed back in 2013 in April. It was bottled uh, in February of last year, 2015. They barrel age it for 18 months. They blend it with 10 gallons of fresh Silva Stout. Uh, and essentially, it's just awesome. <laughs> uh, very loved by a lot of people, the regular Silva Stout, but I've heard great things about the Right, and it's version. their double stout, they call it. It's 10.1% it, yeah, ABV. And yes. watch it pop its top. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Uh, Ooh. Mr. Uh, Air Francois, okay. let's get you a pour. <laughs> Ooh, I like, and I like we, we've the look got, of We've that. got some beer here. So well, let here's here we the go. Josh getting oh, married in 18 months. <laughs> <laughs> here's to, here's to yeah. Josh. Yeah, here's to yeah. Josh. Cheers. 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 Okay, we're going to get the we're nose. We're just going for it. <laughs> oh, we're just going nose. for it. Going run. We got to do the nose. It sniffs good. Sniffs great. Have a taste. All right, here we go. Really not formal. Let's see it. Well, my nose is wet. Yeah, yeah. Mm. <laughs> kind of like a dog. So here, if here. I splash some water on my nose. Look at that wet nose. <laughs> I do smell it. it you you it's can got smell hydraulics more to it. So let's try to let's try to this pull it back here. For this a is fun. This has got wow. I get I get some chocolate. I totally get Absolutely. the barrel age. I, I, is it bourbon barrel? Because, man, I'm getting bourbon. Yeah, it is. I'm so getting the bourbon. I'm so getting the oak barrel mm -hmm. on there. But wow. I also get some chocolate and some rich caramel on there, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you get chocolate, rich caramel. Mm -hmm. But the bourbon definitely takes over uh, on this beer, for sure. You know, and the oakiness. I don't, mm -hmm. You know what's funny for me is I'm actually getting more of a whiny oak flavor yes. to me. Really? That's what I'm getting. Yeah, more of a whiny oak. I, I I'm not saying it tastes like wine. I'm just saying I'm getting more of a whiny So you're getting oak. some vinous character. Yeah. Yeah, mm. I'm getting the bourbon. I just get what I'm getting, and what you might be perceiving as whiny, is I'm getting tannins from the oak. Okay. Yeah. Which is a really common thing to be pulling yeah. from the wine, or the tannins. I would agree. I would agree. Is in, there uh, wine in this one? Tannins. Too? Like he was saying, you get tannins yeah. from the wood, from the yeah. you know flavors yeah. of the wood. I yeah. would think that these are. So I guess are, yeah, best is. But it's a barrel age. It's a barrel age. like they're fresh bourbon barrels instead of like uh, right I aged agree. because you can taste the tannins. Yeah, I, I agree. Here's the thing: most of the time when you're getting barrel aged stuff, it's six months, mm -hmm. three months, maybe nine months, and sometimes a year. It's so rare that you have something in the barrel more than a year. Well, and that's 18 months. That's 18 that's months beautiful. before they get it uh, and bottle it, which the bottling date on here was February 16th, 2015. That's a, yeah. yeah. And we're having it almost close to well, a month off of a year later yeah. off of the 18 months. So add another 12, you know, in the bottle. So I think you're getting really fresh barrels, like a one-time right. use bourbon yeah. barrels. And so you're still getting a lot of tannins from American oak. There's also American oak and French oaks different. The French oaks like more south than the American oak does bring a more interesting wood character to it, which is fun. This is my lovely Aunt Colette. She wants to join in. My you may little, recognize her from three years ago. I don't <laughs> she agree. made an appearance. That's right. <laughs> and What's that? Drinking Tecate. <laughs> it's tea for terrible. <laughs> Anyways, 
Well, that's Kevin. Let's let's. Uh, this beer was right. brought for Kevin. I want to hear Kevin's final All right, thoughts. Okay, so you chased me down for silver stuff. For a yeah, while. this is good. I'm I'm digging on it. I, that extra time in the barrel, extra, yeah. I think, pays off big. And I think that they made this big enough to really make this work. Um, you're getting that chocolate, but you're getting lots of caramel in those flavors. Uh, beautiful. So I have to give this a world-class rating this time. I, I, I think this is a beautiful beer. I'm going to go 97. I really am digging on this for an imperial style. For me personally, um, maybe we had a little, a little too cold. We rushed in this beer, but... Um, for me personally, on this one, I'm, I actually have to just give this one a solid 90. This is an wow. A beer. Um, I like it. I dig it. But um, there's something about that fresh barrel characteristic huh. that you know that I'm, just, okay I'm not with digging. It. Yeah, yeah, I'm not digging it. So that's me, 90. It's an A. See, Josh and I are on the same scope on this one. Like for as much as they put into this beer, I give it an 89. It's just a B. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Like it's just you know it's good, but it's it's, it's just, very good. It's just yeah. that's how I felt about many, the regular. There's too many oh, distractions yeah. uh, taken away from uh, what could be a great beer. Yeah, yeah. Wow. And Mr. Wow, Ora Francois, we. Oui. <laughs> if you're a dark beer, syrupy. You know, stout drinker, which when it comes to beer, this is what I prefer. Right. I think this is definitely A plus. A plus? Nice. I think, it, I think We're this brothers. is really. <laughs> they are related. I think so, so, once again, guys, from Green Flash, the Cellar 3 Barrel Aging. Have division. you ever seen the Green Flash? It's the Silva Stout, the 2015 bottled in February. Uh, what, what can we say? But life is too short to drink cheap beer. And we will see you. Next beer when, with next some more beer, beer on the next beer review. <laughs> That's right. All right. We'll see you next time, guys. Cheers. <laughs>